and today you will see the goodness of god how good our god is and when you get killed that time our god will get the glory otherwise the devil is keeping you in bondage saying that uh, you try hard and you get prosper and god will get the glory no it is through the works which you can see through me god gets the glory if there are no works from my life god not get the glory jesus said father through the things i do you gets the glory so this means what welcome everyone on the live i am there on the live almost every day once or twice so please if you need any healing do come and we will use this time for the glory of god so please don't leave the live no matter what the devil is putting in your mind just be stubborn and tell the devil in the name of jesus to leave you tell the devil that you are the child of god and you want to listen to the word of god so whatever your plans for the day on the social media tell them to leave you and be here on my life until i am there i don't know how long i will be so it depends on my business if i get busy i will leave so if you need any healing please do join me i will see if i got any message on my chat for healing or prayers please all right here i need healing i need prayers and send me the request i will accept your invite so faith faith is the substance of things for the evidence not seen and now faith without action is dead so if you think that you have faith in god but you are not able to heal the sick or people who ask prayers to you people who ask you to pray for them they do not get healed they do not get healed there is no healing in their life but you are saying that you will pray for them this is not faith these are empty promises jesus never told anyone that he will pray for them first we must empower the people and show them how the system works and then make them to pray you pray along with them you show them how to pray you pray and let them repeat after you you make the prayer for them put words in their mouth do not say that you will pray no where one or two are gathered in my name so both of you you need to pray first you pray their prayer and let them repeat with you you don't pray for them so when they get this that the words need to come out from their mouth then they come to know that this is the system to be used in the kingdom of god faith without action is dead so if you just tell them that you will pray and they don't get healed your faith is dead that means there is no holy spirit inside you you don't have guts to pray by laying your hands on them the devil has chicken out if anybody needs healing please write in the chat i need healing or i need prayers and then please send me the request i will accept it because i cannot accept any random invitation to join live together with them our life is short as you know maximum 120 years so we just cannot waste our time on gossiping with somebody else so please i'm on the live if you need prayers please write i need prayer or i need healing then send me the request and i will accept your invitation so everybody have faith but if there is holy spirit inside you then your faith will show actions your faith will do works so this is what faith is to use the available power of god if there are no actions if there are no healings if there are no works then your faith is not of god you are into the bondage you do not have guts to lay your head and command the sickness to leave because you have been chicken out by the devil so when you operate without actions when you live without works i mean the works and actions is the healing 
prosperity and solving the problems in the people's life. Not that you give the money and solve the problem, no. It has to be a miracle, supernatural. The money which you earned is not the good money. The Bible says it will decrease and that what you gather by righteousness will increase. So if anybody needs any healing, please do. Write in the chat, I need healing, I need prayers. And then, please send the request. So I will know that you are genuine. And I will accept your invitation. Because I don't want to lose the time with any Tom, Dick and Harry. Because the life we have is maximum 120 years. We just cannot waste it on gossiping. We must tell the truth to all the people. And... People will come to know that you have faith in God, that you are a child of God. Only when they see miracles and wonders through you, you cannot faith the Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit will show signs and wonders only through the person in whom he is dwelling. So Holy Spirit needs to dwell in you. So you cannot fake and you cannot say that you will pray and never nothing will happen. So you cannot fake people that you will pray for them. If Holy Spirit is inside you, the Holy Spirit will put the words in your mouth to command the sickness to leave them rather than faking out and saying that you will pray for them. Your intercessory team will pray for them. Your praying team will pray for them. If this was the case, Jesus did not have to come. There was no need of Jesus to come. If somebody can pray for you, if somebody can intercede for you, there was no need of Jesus. God himself would have stopped what is going into the world, what bad is going in your life. Somebody don't need to pray or intercede for you. That means God cannot do anything. If you think that your praying committee, your interceding committee will pray for the people, that means God cannot do anything. Why God need somebody to intercede for others? God cannot do it directly. God has created every human in his own image and likeness. Only the interceding committee or group or praying group, only they are not made in the image and likeness of God. All humans are made in the image and likeness of God. 